Hello, it is Tamwin from the future. I just got back from Leeds, but in today's video, I'm sharing with you guys what I eat on a cheat day in Leeds. So today is a cheat day and was yesterday because this weekend has just been a date weekend for me and James. Um, we went to Leeds last night and stayed over. We did drunk jack off and then watched Black Widow on the cinema. So that was really fun and we then like obviously stayed over. So I videoed the food, however, it's been like 31 degrees today, so neither of us were really in the mood to get lunch. We're gonna get breakfast and lunch and then come back and do shopping, but neither of us were really in the mood to be in Leeds at 31 degrees. So we came back earlier and didn't actually go for lunch. So that is why there is only a tiny bit of food in Leeds, but I'm gonna show you guys what I've had for tea. I'm really sorry that this video is quite short, but you know, we deal with things and the fact that we didn't get food was actually pretty normal. We normally just get one meal and come back pretty early. But the heat was just too much for us. But yes, I hope you still like this video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe down below and put the notification bell to be notified every time I do upload. And I really do hope that you enjoy this video. I just wanted to show you guys what I actually got in Leeds. I didn't film it because obviously I was with James and I don't really like filming it with him because um, it's our time and stuff. But I just want to show you guys what I got in Leeds and some books. So I'll start off with the books. So I actually went into Waterstones and I got two books. Um, the first one is The House in the Gorillon Sea. This book it's so floppy i love the floppiness of it <laughs> it just makes my heart happy how floppy it is um but yeah i got this this has just been imported from america like really recently now i didn't think that i thought this was going to be like nine pounds tops because that's normally what books are um but unfortunately this was 15 pounds but i guess why because it's like quite expensive in America too so it's kind of understandable why it was that much but I didn't realise. I just picked it and was like oh that was really good um, but I haven't really seen many YouTubers talking about this so not YouTubers, TikTokers is like in the UK and stuff talking about this so I'm going to try this out. I had like four books so I went through them and the next one was Ace of Space that I got this was £9. It is on the buy one get one half price but I didn't see any other half price things that I wanted because I was gonna get it ends with us or something like that one by Colleen something or other and that was half price like in Huddersfield but it wasn't half price in the one in Leeds so I didn't get that um, like I wanted to with Ace of Spades which is really annoying I knew this was gonna be like this um, but you know also I didn't get the limited edition version like I wanted because they've run out of stock um but yeah and then in Sainsbury's the other day, I got the Midnight Library. So, yeah, this is by Matt Haig. It's really good. Um, supposedly really good. I've read, got some really good reviews. Um, this is kind of turned into a haul. Please haul. Hey. I don't know why I did that. I, the, this heat is just going to my head. It's been like 31 degrees. Um, and then I went in two bands. 
Jews wanted some vans, which I've kind of been swearing to get for about a year now, and he had tried them on and was like, yeah, I'm getting one. So he got some, and then the person was like, oh, the women's are upstairs, and well, I went upstairs and found the men's one, the ones I really liked, but in the women's section. Um, so yeah. They are a shoe that I love. Um, so I have some peach ones, and my peach ones give me blisters, and I love old school vans, but like my high top ones, they really hurt my soul, so I don't wear them as much. Um, my peach ones give me blisters, so I've just not been wearing vans, and that's not me. I have been for about four or five years out of vans, and because I have a short pair of Converse up there as well, so I'm, but they're too thin on my feet, but vans aren't. Um, so I got these. These are in sale for about £42, which I think is actually really good. They've got my favourite, like, the vans off the wall tag um, on the tongue, which was one of the selling points because my graphic design brain. Um, these are the Ultra Crush ones. So these are actually ones for skaters. And the way my heels are, I walk weird, so that'll be really good for my heels. And then it's just this bright that blue and I wear like a lot of black on white I hardly ever wear colour apart from my blue jeans so I thought this was just a pop of colour for outfits that's just gonna go pop and also it's like a cream not a white which I also love and I just saw these and I fell in love and they were in the sale as well which was amazing and then um, I needed some socks to go because I was talking to the guy about my blister and he was like it's your socks just your socks um i'd say get some vans ones because they're they're made for vans um so i looked at the tall ones but i don't wear tall socks i hate wearing them i wear them with my dogs that's about it um so i got these ones so they're checkered vans which i love this style. and i love the checkered ones like they're just so cool but it's like a little check with like the vans logo but just like and as you can see they come higher on your ankle so they'll still be taller than the shoe by quite a bit but they're not gonna like annoy me because they're so tall um but yeah these are my beautiful new shoes so yeah um, but yeah that's my whole over yeah um i just thought i'd add this whole into this video because this video isn't very long and i kind of knew that was coming from the kind of when we stopped getting when we just was shopping and just getting too hot so i thought i would add this whole in just to have a bit more content kind of thing um so yeah I'm going to end the video here though, so I do hope that you really enjoyed this video and if you did, can you put a thumbs up? Can you comment down below? Um, um, so the question is, are you a Converse wearer or a Vans wearer? Um, obviously Vans wearer through and through, I have one pair of Converse and about five pairs of Vans. One of them needs to get chucked, the other one I don't wear, my dad wears, but you know, I have three pairs now on my own, so I'm a Vans person. Um, and subscribe, click the next video and subscribe every time I do upload. I'm going to be doing lots and lots and lots of videos. I'm going to be doing, I'll be trying and doing like different diet. I'm going to be doing like furniture, just um, 24 hour challenges. I am starting work very soon, which I haven't had before. So it's a whole new world. So if there's short videos like this and just on the go videos, that is why, because I am working basically full time um from monday till friday and then the weekends are free so that's what i'm probably going to be trying to film is the weekend of doing weekly videos but i'm not showing my lunches or something like that because obviously i don't know staff well enough so yeah just to let you guys know if videos are a bit slow or anything like that that is why i need to be filming like ahead every week to get on top but i think it'll be okay so yeah i hope that's okay and well, it, if i i will speak to you guys if i'm getting behind and things like that um i will see you guys next time in my next video and i hope that you've enjoyed the video